Hello, on uh, Friday, August 29th, I received a vision, and the vision um, starts off with the ocean, and I saw a man coming out of the ocean. He was crawling, um, he was on his hands and knees, yeah, and he crawled out onto the sand. And then I saw him, you know, his handprint on the sand. I saw a red scorpion crawl out onto the sand. And then he stood up. He was wearing swimming shorts, uh, but around his neck he had a plastic bag. And this was the type of uh, flat plastic bag that people use whenever they want to keep their phones dry. Inside the flat plastic bag was a triangle symbolizing the Illuminati. I then saw what looked like a parent and it looked like they were sad, like they were at a funeral. So that was the vision, and I didn't know what to do. It's like, well, I don't know. And so that's I just prayed and waited to see if there would be something else, you know, if, if our Lord Jesus would show me something else about this vision. And then sure enough, on uh, September 9th, we, we have uh, the, the release of the iPhone 6. And I think that's what this vision was about, because that that plastic bag, uh, we went on a trip, and I remember that flat plastic bag is if you want to get into the water, you're going to go canoeing, you don't want your phone to get wet, and so you put your phone into that kind of flat, thick plastic bag to keep it safe from the water. And so, but instead of the phone, it was that Illuminati triangle. And... Um, so to me, it's like, okay, well, it could be the New World Order, but I wasn't real sure, so that's why I waited. And so here we have September 9th, 2014, the release of the iPhone 6. and But this phone here uh, includes the capability of a person that they can add a chip into their hand, and then they can control their phone with that chip. And the chip is being marketed right now as a form of identification. Let me scroll up a little bit. Okay. Um, the thing about the um, the nine also is that if you, you know, and so I want to compare it to like a pentagram. You know, see a pentagram is that, you know, five-pointed star. But if you take all the angles inside a pentagram and you count them all together, you know, you, a triangle is, uh, I mean, not angles, the 180 degrees inside a triangle, 180, it's 540. So when you add that all up, it, all together, the number of angle uh, degrees is 1,440. And then you add those numbers, it becomes a 9. So then, and then here you have, on September 9th, the release of the iPhone 6. You know, having to do with the chip, the mark of the beast, the Illuminati, uh, so, yep, that goes along with the New World Order and, um, you know, them wanting to use the, the phone as a way to get people to willingly, please put the chip in me so I can control my phone, you know, and, and um, other things like that. So, no, don't fall for it. You know, say no to the Mark of the Beast. Say no to the RFID chip. Um, they're saying, well, you can put the chip in your left hand. No, 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 do not play games with the Lord. You know, Mark of the Beast, right hand or left hand, it's still the Mark of the Beast, and you do not accept it. Okay. Um, at this point, I'm just going to read uh, Revelation uh, chapter 13. Uh, but yeah, the main thing also, yeah, just tr stay with Lord Jesus, trust in our Lord. You don't want to go there. You know, you, you want to stay far, far away from having anything to do with, with Satan don't let the mark of the beast get on your hand or anywhere, you know. Uh, don't take any kind of pills. They say, just take this, you know, because they do have a RFID chip that you can swallow and it'll get stuck inside you and never come out. Okay. So here we have Revelation 13. And I stood upon the sand of the sea, and I saw a beast rise up out of the sea, having seven heads, ten horns, and upon his horns, ten crowns, and upon his head the name of blasphemy. And the beast which I saw was like unto a leopard, and his feet were as the feet of a bear, 
and his mouth as the mouth of a lion. And the dragon gave him his power, and his seat and great authority. And I saw one of his heads as if as it were wounded to death, and his deadly wound was healed, and all the world wondered after the beast. And they worshipped the dragon which gave power unto the beast, and they worshipped the beast, saying, Who is like unto the beast? Who is able to make war with him? And there was given upon, I mean, unto him a mouth, speaking great things and blasphemies, and power was given unto him to continue forty and two months. And he opened his mouth in blasphemy against God, to blaspheme his name and his tabernacle, and them that dwell in heaven. And it was given unto him to make war with the saints, and to overcome them, and power was given him over all kindreds and tongues and nations. And all that dwell upon the earth shall worship him, whose names are not written in the book of life of the Lamb, slain from the foundation of the world. If any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the patience and the faith of the saints. And I beheld another beast coming up out of the earth, and he had two horns like a lamb, and he spake as a dragon. And he exercised all the power of the first beast before him, and causeth the earth and them which dwell therein to worship the first beast, whose deadly wound was healed. And he doth great wonder, so that he might maketh fire come down from heaven on the earth in the sight of men, and deceiveth them that dwell on the earth by the means of those miracles which he had power to do in the sight of the beast, saying to them that dwell on the earth that they shall make an image of the beast, which had the wound by a sword, and did live. And he that had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak, and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. And he causeth but all both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive the mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. And that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the name number of his name. Here is wisdom, let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of the man, and his number is six hundred three score and six, and that's six six six. Um, I skipped over the part about, it looked like the parent was at a funeral, and one of the things is, uh, well, who buys the phone? You know, the kid wants a phone. Who buys the phone is the parent. And so, yeah, you know, the parents will be sad. It's like, oh, no, my kid uh, now has the mark of the beast. My kid is now affected. You know, I won't be able to go to heaven. So the parents, you know, would be sad. So, yeah, no, don't don't get the iPhone 6. Um, or just don't, don't get the chip. If you buy the iPhone 6, just, you know, you're not going to have the chip. So, all right. Thanks, everyone, and God bless.